So today we're going to talk about a perfume house from India that is, I'll say, an affordable luxury because, uh, like I say, you do not need to smell more in order to smell good. And uh, this is again one another example of uh, uh, some amazing stuff that are under budget and um, they smell absolutely amazing to be honest so today we have alternate scents perfume combo so this is the entire combo and uh, this is like a you know it has seven pieces of 20 ml perfume so you get like uh, 140 ml juice entirely of uh, a different different perfume so first of all this is how the main presentation looks like and here you get all the information about whatever perfume it has so let's say if you are looking for amber leather so you'll get all the information about the notes of amber leather how to spray and uh, each and everything the ingredients and stuff so in that way you won't need to look for the notes let's say if you're exploring a perfume you won't need to look for the notes on the website you have everything here and um, i'll just open the box here now this is very nice even the bottom of the box is protected so that you know the bottles will stay intact and here we go just look at it how colorful this is <laughs> so it has all the perfumes so it has basically seven perfumes out of them six are inspired from high-end perfumes and one is their private blend so i'll quickly talk about them one by one so that you can at least know what exactly are you expecting out of it just in answer for the people who are interested the price is 11.99 right now when i'm making this video so all the information i'll be mentioning in the description box so the first one that i'll be talking about is mr y which is this one now this is their take on ysly so just take a look at this one i mean i cannot show you the bo original bottle right now because of the copyright issue but then um, if you have seen YSLY, if you can just Google YSLY, you'll be able to know how good the presentation of this one is. So, you know, they try to imitate the presentation as well to make you feel that you are some using something that is extremely close to the original one. In terms of notes, it has apple, wallet leaf, geranium, musk, incense and vetiver. Now, this is a kind of scent profile that you can wear anytime, anywhere. It's an aquatic, fresh and clean kind of scent profile. So, it is definitely not going to offend anyone. And as this is a 20 ml bottle, as everything that I'm going to review right now is 20 ml bottle, you can carry them anywhere. You can keep them in your blazer, in your jeans, in your trousers, whatever. If you are a woman, you can keep them in your bag. So, it is extremely convenient and travel friendly. The second one that we have is Amber Leather this one and this is their take on ombre leather again i cannot show you the bottle the original bottle but then if you have seen that bottle you'll be able to correlate with how the presentation is similar it is a leather prominent perfume so if you love fragrances like tuscan leather if you fragrance you know if you love fragrances like you know la you and all that this is something that is uh, a toned down version of that and uh Ombre leather is one of the best seller and if you like that perfume of course you're gonna love this one the prominent notes here are cedar wood jasmine leather orris tobacco and woody notes i feel this is the best date night perfume extremely manly and something you can wear even at the party and uh, it's a kind of perfume that is like a um, masculinity in a bottle i mean i always imagine a guy wearing a leather jacket if you are wearing this perfume you know it, it gives us impression of being an alpha male the third one that we're going to talk about is uh, one of my favorite from this entire list now it is one of my favorite here it is satin oud by the way and it is one of my favorite and one of my favorite even from the original perfume so this imitates oud satin mood now this is a very thick dark resinous and incense rose imagine a rose that is dipped in vanilla and everything sweet plus oud that is how i can you know explain this perfume to someone who is uh, not into fragrances the prominent notes here are bulgarian rose turkish rose vanilla oud and benzoin so this is two kinds of rose of course and uh, when i say this i'm talking about all the perfumes that i've tested from this house all the perfumes are extremely close to the original perfume so you know we're talking about like uh, 90 to 95 percent similarity there is always going to be some differences but then again you know you can expect it because uh, um, these are like one tenth of the cost now let me show you the sprayer i wanted to show you the sprayer as well the sprayer is just a minute okay this is how the sprayer is so it is good you know 
could have been better but then uh, like i've said it is a budget alternative and these are 20 ml bottles so um, i think you can let this one slide for this time if you're looking for um, uh, you know something that is a very very nice alternative of oats satin mood under budget that too for 20 ml bottle you can try this one out the fourth one is uh, savage elixir now savage elixir is their take on dior sauvage elixir now this is i mean i'm talking about the original one the original one was one of the best seller of 2022 and 2023 I, I suppose it was released in 2022 or 2023 i'm not sure but then whatever year it was released it was the best seller i couldn't actually relate that much to that scent profile at back then when it was released i was i i, I reviewed that when it was released immediately in india uh, but right now I am in love with that scent profile and if you love that perfume and or if you're looking for a budget alternative of Dior Sauvage Elixir you can try this one out. Prominent notes here are nutmeg, cinnamon, grapefruit, lavender, vetiver, patchouli and amber. If you love lavender like manly kind of lavender you are going to love this one I mean the original one and this one and uh, this is like uh, i feel that this is like uh, the best office wear perfume um if you wear this uh, at an event or something you are going to be like something extremely serious and like, like a guy who is serious and uh, uh, not serious 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 about his work and all that but uh, you know it is very professional kind of scent profile in my opinion uh the previous one this one uh, satin oud i feel this is the best date night or party wear perfume this one, on the other hand, is the best office wear interview scent or maybe if you're someone going at the college, you can use this one. The next one that we're going to talk about is, uh, okay, <laughs> this is uh, Red Crystal Rouge 540, which is their take on Baccarat Rouge 540. Uh, I know there are a lot of alternatives of Baccarat Rouge 540 in the market and uh, it totally depends on what is your personal preference but then here you are getting this perfume in the set. So in case you haven't tried that DNA you can try this one out. Nowadays to be honest every perfume every alternative of Baccarat Rouge 540 is better than the original one because the original one costs like more than 38, 39,000 rupees. So whatever you get is better than the original one in that case because uh, you are getting like you're paying like maybe less than one tenth of the price and you're getting like 80 to 90 percent similar perfume this on the other hand is you know more similar but then still just for your reference in that way this is good the prominent notes here are almond saffron jasmine cedar wood ambergris and musky notes i love the bottle color here i mean just look at it it is vibrant you know it resembles the original one of course but then it is good and uh yeah i mean it's a nice scent profile honestly i don't prefer the scent profile this is my personal preference but then there are a lot of people who are into this so just an answer the next one is aqua g10 which is this one which is their take on aqua dto uh, i feel this is somewhere in between edp and edt so yeah the best office wear scent it's a kind of scent profile that is extremely playful safe to wear and elegant and uh, not a single person or soul will be um, you know offended by this kind of scent profile that is that is what i feel and uh, it is good it is safe and uh, yeah uh, great fresh aquatic and clean the prominent notes here are lime lemon bergamot orange neroli musk cedar wood oak moss and amber just see the color of this bottle you know that is how this entire scent profile is and even the original one even the original aqua digio is uh, you know the bottle is of the same color so it, it is done really well and the last one that we have is sultan and this is their private blend as far as i know i i didn't actually get any uh, resemblance of this perfume to any other perfume available in the market now this is a very nice combination of fresh and oody notes i know uh, a little bit unique combination but then yeah it is fresh it is oody and at the same time it is sweet as well this smells fresh aquatic it has oud it has spices it has citrusy elements to it you know you'll get citrus out of it and the top note this is what i get apart from that it has a lot of spices i sense some kind of fruit in it and it is the same fruit that i you know in it, that i get in a lot of citrusy perfume so not one specific perfume but then in a lot of citrusy perfume so in that way it is good and uh, it is definitely unique so they've done one good thing like they have given you a lot of alternatives 
plus if you're looking for one signature scent you can try this one out because this is unrelated to any other perfume so these are seven scents and uh, like i've said you can try and wear every perfume every day and every day you're going to smell different so it depends on your mood as well i mean whatever your mood is whatever your uh, occasion is and whatever your, the place where you're going is you can change your perfume you don't need to get the full bottles you can simply get this experience set or gift set or travel set whatever you say and uh, at the end of the day if you you know if you feel like uh, you are resonating with certain scent profile out of these i mean let's say if you are more into fresh scent profile i mean you're a person who is more into fresh perfumes and you like this one you can always order the full bottle so you know first you get multiple perfumes then you try them out and finally you upgrade to a full bottle that is how the perfume shopping should be if you are blind buying stuff so yeah, good stuff for this price point uh, i'll mention all the details in the description in case you're interested we'll see you in the next one